I'm Brooke and this is part two of my free funnel building guide with, through System.io. Part one we left off with the menu. Today we're going to go ahead and select funnels and you're going to come up to this oops page. You can see up in the right left hand corner you're going to be selecting create. And it's going to bring up this pop-up with several items in it. Your funnel name is just something for you to distinguish it from other funnels that you might build in the future. Your domain is an automatic one generated by System. You can change this later. You're going to choose which one of these four categories best fits your purpose. For us, we are going to be building an audience. And then you're going to switch your currency to whatever currency is your region. And then scroll down, hit create. After we hit create, we're going to be given our squeeze page, our thank you page. These names can be changed once again, and we can add more steps if we need to. If we want to remove a step, there is a tiny little trash can over here on the side. So if you wanted a single step funnel, you can just remove it. At the bottom of the screen, you're going to see that there are several templates for you to choose from. Remember, you can change everything within the template, so this does not have to be set in stone. And just because you don't think it's perfect for what you need doesn't mean that you can't go ahead and start with it. For this test, we're going to set up a food-related niche, and we're going to select this one right here. As you can see, it's loaded the template into our URL path. We can change this to something more specific for us, whatever we want to put in there. And then to start editing, we're going to go over here and hit this little magic button right here. This will load your template into the editor. And from here, you can start editing as you wish. Uh, this is going to be it for part two. Stay tuned for part three and we'll start getting into editing. Whenever you're done, make sure you save changes. It does not automatically save. If you want to get back to the dashboard, you can hit this button right here. And it will take you back to your template building. Hit back to the dashboard like that. Have a nice night.